Analysts Louis Fernandez and Brett Thompson are back with us. Thank goodness. Louis, now you're a senior. I want to start with you. Tell us your predictions for tonight's game. All right. Well, you know, of course, I got to pick Carolina. That's just how it is. You know, you, you got to pick Carolina when you, you're a UNC student. But what's really interesting to me is that I think Villanova, Carolina, it's going to be a great championship game. One better than we've seen in quite some time. You have two really good teams who have been playing amazing in the tournament with really wide margins of victory. Um, and they both like to play a high-paced style. So I'm thinking a lot of offense. I'm going to go 79-72 for a symbolic reason. And that symbolic reason being that that's what UNC um, scored when they lost to Wisconsin uh, in that uh, tournament last year when they lost in the Sweet 16. Okay, Brett. Oh, man. Well, those are bad vibes over there. I'll tell you what. I, I tried to talk about this beforehand and say that I was going to pick the team wearing blue, but that's a cop-out, apparently. I'm not allowed to say that. So, I, I feel like these are two very good offenses, which makes me think it's going to be a little lower scoring than what we've seen from these two teams. I'm going to say Carolina falls behind by about seven in the second half. They storm back for a 78-69 to victory for the national championship. Really specific. Really, really specific. nice prediction yeah, I there. I, I have to go a little bit closer. I'm going to say it's going to be about 78, 76. And I got to go Carolina, of course. That's why we're wearing our blue. Um, but I just I, I just have this feeling it's going to be such a close game. And we're going to just see something crazy exciting. Because national championship, why not, right? Of course. And now, guys, my prediction is based off of one thing and one thing only. That is Jimmy Fallon's puppy prediction show that happened this weekend. Can't go wrong with guys, puppies. Guys, they picked UNC. So I'm going to have to go with that and follow the puppies' lead and say that we're going to come out with the win. Puppies know best. Puppies yeah. know best. Brett, do you have a player to watch for us? I do, and it's the same player I picked at the beginning of the season to make a huge impact. I'm going to say Theo Pinson is the player to watch. He's given UNC a spark in the second half so many times in this tournament. I love Theo. He's a high-energy guy. I, I mean, you, how can you not love Theo Pinson? I'm scared he's going to come up behind me right now and crash our TV show <laughs> one in Houston. What about you, Lewis? Theo Pinson flourish night. Yeah, for real, for real. I think that's a good one. Um, personally, I'm going to go with Isaiah Hicks. Um, but my main thing is Isaiah Hicks has not really been able to do much in the tournament because he's been in foul trouble. He's been in foul trouble, and that's been problematic. So I think this is finally a being night. He's going to go ahead and you know stay out of foul trouble, and he's really going to contribute and be a big part of this team. Lots of bold moves. we got to talk next. Where is everyone going to watch the game? Tell us, Brett. Let's do it quick. Where are you going to go? All right. I'm watching at my house. I'm not a loser. It's going to be with a bunch of my friends. I'm not old enough to go out to bars or whatever. So it's going to be at my house. <laughs> 408 Lindsay Street, if you're watching, come out. What about you guys? I want to come. Come. Okay. I'm going to watch it at home, too. Get to Franklin Street, hopefully. I'll be, I'll be at He's Not Here, the iconic Chapel Hill bar with my blue cup. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to be watching with some friends at an apartment. You know, we've we've uh, watched every single game there so far since Sweet 16, and things have gone well. So fingers crossed, it's good luck, you know? I hope that we have to spend a lot of money mm -hmm. next <laughs> tomorrow on, on some gear, but I don't want to do anything, yeah. right? Yeah. 